Welcome to the lesson that's going to get you started with SongMaker. SongMaker is a fabulous site that allows you to make interesting music. You can explore a lot of these videos to learn how to use SongMaker. Some examples will show how to create a song for something like Stranger Things or Super Mario Brothers. So you're just going to have to go in and really play on the site. Now this is the site. You would come in and start making music. You can change the instruments and so forth. Once you're done, I'm just going to go ahead and set something up. Now trust me, this is not going to be an attractive song, but let's say you make a beautiful song and you want to save it. What you would do is you would click the save option in the bottom right part of the screen, choose download wave. Once you download it, you definitely want to give it a name. So I'll go ahead and go to show in folder. I will right click and choose rename and I'll call this maybe song one. You might want to give it a better name than that. Now once it's saved, you're going to go ahead and go to your Google Drive. And in this case, I did make a folder as if I'm an eighth grader. And there's the eighth grade folder. And it is music, so I'll put it in the music folder. I will choose New, File Upload, and I will double click on that song that I just created. It is now safe in my Google Drive. I do want to point out that on that eighth grade folder, I did right click and change the share settings to anyone with a link. That way, when I share my music, other people can hear my songs. Now that I have at least one song, I'm going to go ahead and open up the template so that I could showcase my music for others to hear. I will choose Use Template in the upper right corner. And once you choose Use Template, it ends up in your Google Drive. Now I'm going to go ahead and go to the folder within the Google Slides, choose Move. I will click on the arrow next to 8th grade because that's where I want to put it. And I'm going to go ahead and put it in Projects and choose move and then move again. Now it's in a safe location in my Google Drive and I'm in a position to edit this slide. I'm going to go to that eighth grade folder, open up music, and I'm going to right click on the song that I just added to this folder. I will right click and choose get link and then copy link and then choose done. I will go to the template. You could choose any of these slides to set up your song you might have this many songs that you want to add links to. So I'll go to the first one. I will select this song name and I'll just call this song one. I will select it. I will go to the hyperlink option. I will right click and choose paste and then apply. Now if you want, you can select that so that the title stands out. Because we changed the hyperlink, it's kind of dark, so I want it to be visible. So I might have to change all my hyperlinks to a, maybe a light shade of yellow to go with the color scheme. So now when people click on this, they will be able to load the song and hear it. This concludes the session on how to get your music from SongMaker and add it to a template. Until next time, you have a wonderful day.